Okay, I went off and hunted around for a schematic or more information about this record player. I can't find anything out except a couple that were for sale, as usual, but no electronic information, no schematic. So I thought, hey, this is a good opportunity to try a capacitor testing technique, um, which I've done once. I don't think I ever did it on video. And I was pretty happy with the results, so I think I'm going to try this again. Okay, so, hear that? That's my audio signal generator being fed straight into uh, a speaker. And I'm simply going to bridge capacitors and listen to the tone. And uh, this is a pretty sloppy test. But because there's really two identical amps in here, I should be able to do lots of comparative stuff. So we're going to start with this capacitor here. A little clumsy with these leads, isn't it? Okay, I'm going to turn it up just a little bit. I want you to hear this. Okay, straight through. Through the capacitor. Same capacitor, different circuit. Same sound, okay? Now we'll try... I think these two here are the same. Sounds the same. Okay, next would be these two here. Let's try that. Sounds the same. It doesn't sound the same. It sounds that way. Here we go. Sounds the same. The last two are these two. This one, this one looks like a replacement. How's that work? I'm looking up one lead and I'm hearing it. I still hear it. I'm sure you can't, but it's very faintly coming through. That's pretty weird. So, that one. Oh, wrong one. This one. So every capacitor I've tested so far it sounds the same. They all sound the same as their brother. Now that either means they're both bad or they're both good. Now the fact is if it's a really bad capacitor, no signal will go through it. Let's try these big guys I just put in here. Okay, a big capacitor. A big let through. So this tells me the problem is probably not one of these capacitors. And that's a little bit unfortunate, isn't it? Because now I'm back to hunting. Uh, it could be a weak tube. But I hope you enjoyed that uh, capacitor test. Yeah, let's throw the frequency down lower. Try it again. This might be too low for you to hear. Same. Same.
same. What's left? What have I not done? I think that's fairly convincing that uh, these. Did I, did I check this odd guy here? Why is this guy here? Why is there only one of these? That's a bit of a mystery why there's only one of these guys. Yeah, so I'm going to have to take a look at the tubes. I think I should test them next, really. So I'll get ready for that.